Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a style session video. I haven't done a style session video in a while and I have barely done any this year. I used to do them at least monthly, almost like bi-weekly or weekly, and I kind of fell out of doing that and I wanna get back into it. So I decided that we're gonna start getting back into the style sessions. If you've never seen one of these videos, I take a piece and I style it multiple different ways to share with you guys that it's a versatile piece and to just give you guys some inspiration from your closet. So if you had bought a new piece or you have it already in your closet and you're stuck in the same way wearing it over and over, hopefully Hopefully this can get the juices flowing and help you guys make the most of your closet. Today we are going to be styling bike shorts and I'm actually not gonna take one bike short but I'm gonna take all of my bike shorts that I have and put an outfit with them. So you can obviously interchange all the bike shorts with these outfits um, but I'm going to take all of my bike shorts. I'm gonna share with you guys what I think of my bike shorts because it's almost like a bike short review here as well um, and style them multiple ways. So. I have some really great bike shorts. I'm like really into them right now. I know they're like a like or hate. I like them because they feel like a, just a short legging and they're just really comfortable and I'm still really into comfort <laughs> even though like things are starting to get back to normal and I do wanna wear like my normal clothes. This is just great for the everyday for me, especially in the summertime when I'm home with my kids. It's just comfortable to wear. So I have different ways that I'm going to wear them. I'm gonna share with you guys all the bike shorts I have, kind of review them. And I want to know for other style sessions what you guys wanna see, because I want to do a couple more this month. So I wanna know if you have a piece in your closet that you're stuck, you don't know how to style it, or if you have maybe an older piece even um, that you have in your closet that you're like, I don't know what to do with this. Let me know in the comments down below what you want to see next to style multiple ways. So we're gonna go ahead and get into the bike shorts. I'll have everything listed and linked down below. Let's get started. All right, so first up, I'm going to be styling my Spanx faux leather bike shorts, and I obviously love the full legging of this, and the bike shorts are really great as well. They're the same thing, just in a short version, and these are fun to kind of dress up and go a little more trendy with, so I'm gonna share with you guys a little bit of a trendier outfit. Um, I think all the other outfits, I'm like looking at them laid out here, all my other outfits are more casual, very like athleisure wear. That's mostly how I wear them. Um, but this one's a little bit fun and a little more trendy that I think would be a fun way to wear them if you'd want to. Um, but the Spanx full leather bike shorts are great. I get a size small in them and I'll share with you guys the outfit. All right, so these are the faux leather bike shorts from Spanx. I love them. If you own the leggings, the bike short version is like identical, just like shorter. Um, so they're very smoothing, very compressive. Um, I go with my normal size small in them and I paired it with an oversized button up, which you can easily do without this blazer. But then I also layered a blazer over it. I think it's super cute. But again, you can just wear like the oversized button up. You could even tie the button up up a little bit. Um, there's a lot of different ways you can style it. Um, and then I also, I just put on some low top sneakers with it. You can easily change it out for a sandal. Um, I usually, with my bike shorts, I usually just wear sneakers or sandals. Um, you can probably pair a mule with it or like a slide. That might be really cute as well. Um, but I just tend to always grab a sneaker or a sandal. All right, next pair of bike shorts I have here are these. These are a little bit, um, this is actually my shortest pair you can kind of see. I'm not sure the inseam on this one, but these are actually from Abercrombie. Abercrombie has really nice bike shorts, super comfortable, really soft, like a cottony material. So I highly suggest them. They're at a really great pr price point as well. These are actually their seamless ribbed ones. So they're ribbed. Um, this is the gray color. They come in a bunch of other colors as well. I get my normal size small in them and they are just so soft. So I'm going to share with you guys a way to wear them. I love them. I think they are so comfortable. All right, next up are the ribbed seamless bike shorts from Abercrombie. I think I said this, they are definitely my shortest pair. I think they're like maybe a six inch 
or a five inch inseam. So they're definitely on the shorter side um, compared to all my other ones, but they are just so comfortable. I absolutely love them. Um, and I paired it with a crew neck sweater also from Abercrombie. This is one of my favorite sweaters. I own it in like three different colors because it is so comfortable and it's just so easy and basic and it goes with so many things. So I really love pairing like a knit sweater with bike shorts. I think it's really cute, um, especially in the fall going a little bit of a chunkier sweater on top I think would be really cute. Obviously we are heading into summer. Um, so a lightweight sweater is a great option. And then I also paired it with these pool slides from H&M, so comfortable. I love this look, definitely an everyday wear for me. All right, next up, I'm going to be styling these right here. These are my white ones. Ooh, it looks really bright on the screen here. Um, but these are my oldest pair that I've had, and this is from Aloe. I actually own them in the black as well. I really like the Aloe ones. They are, they're comfortable. They are more, they're probably, out of all of mine, they're my most compressive. So they're very compressive. Um, they're great for working out in, but they're also great for everyday wear. Um, I'm not gonna style my black ones because I'm gonna share my favorite black ones next, um, but I love their white ones. I actually tried a different pair of white ones actually the same one that I'm gonna share next in white. I did not like those, I actually prefer these. So if you're looking for a cute pair of white ones, the aloe ones to me are the best ones out there. They're really thick, they're not see-through, they kind of smooth everything out. And like I said, they're very compressive. So I'm gonna share with you guys an outfit with these. All right, next up are the white aloe bike shorts. I love these, they are so cute. Um, I love styling these white bike shorts so many different ways as well. I kind of more wear them for the everyday, but the aloe ones are really great for workouts as well. So if you wanna work out in them, they are great for that. They're very compressive. Um, the white are not see-through, they're very thick um, in material. So they're just really comfortable. Um, so I paired a neutral little kind of tunic length sweatshirt and then also put a denim jacket over it. You can easily just take this off or wear a t-shirt with it. There's so many different ways. Um, but this is the look that I, I love kind of wearing a lighter look with the white bike shorts and then also some sneakers on the bottom. All right, next up, my favorite black bike short is by far the Lululemon Align. They are so soft, they are so comfortable. I love them, um, and like I said, I did try them out in the white, <laughs> like I just said in the previous ones, and I actually didn't prefer them. I didn't like them as much as I do the aloe. The aloe's quite a bit thicker, um, they're just more compressive, and I feel like they smoothed things a little better because the aligns are a little bit on the thinner side. Um, the, the white ones were not see-through. They were definitely double-lined um, in the align ones, but I just prefer a little bit thicker for the white. So if you're looking for a good white one, I suggest the aloe ones over the aligns, but for any other color, they are so good. Um, so I'm gonna share with you guys how I wear these. All right, so here is my Lululemon Align. Like I said, this is the eight inch inseam. So they're a little bit on the longer side, which I like. Um, the six inch would probably hit about here. Um, and then the tens are just way too long for me. But I just paired it with an oversized graphic sweatshirt. You can easily change this out for a t-shirt. Um, but I love a graphic print with bike shorts. And then I also pair my favorite mango quilted sandals with it. Super comfortable. This is something I would wear on the everyday and be able to just be comfortable all day. So I love this. And like I said, the Lululemon Align bike shorts are my absolute favorite. All right, I love the Lululemon Align bike shorts so much that I also got them recently in this green. I still have the tag on even. I haven't worn them yet, but I love this green color. I don't wear green very often, and I just really loved it because it's a very muted green, almost like a gray green, and I just, I think they're so cute. Um, for the inseam, there's multiple different lengths that you can get in the Lululemon Align. You can get a 10 inch, an eight inch, six inch, and a four four inch. I get the eight inch. Um, the six inch is just maybe like a tad short for me. I could do the six inch very easily, but the 10 inch is way too long and the four inch is just like booty shorts for me. So I prefer a little bit longer. Um, 
so I go for the 8 inch and I think they're super comfortable so I'm going to go ahead and style the green ones. These are the other pair of Lulu Align ones that I got. I love this color and I just paired it. This is like a workout outfit that I would wear with obviously sneakers and then a cropped basic tank. Um, I'm sure all of you kind of have something similar in your closet, but this is how I would wear them to work out. And then I also wanted to share, I half zips are like everywhere right now. They're like the thing. And I love a good half zip sweatshirt. So you can easily pair a half zip over it after your workout or just wear it like this for the day. Um, but a half zip is super cute. This one's a little bit older from Aerie, but I'll, I think they have super similar ones right now. So I'll link a couple down below. Um, but half zips, either, either cropped or long, I think would look really cute with the bike shorts. All right, last up, I have this pair right here. It is a print, kind of fun, crazy print. Um, these are by a brand called Onesie. I got them off of Shopbop. I think they're available at Revolve as well. Um, but they are a shiny bike short. They're definitely a bolder print, but I actually really love these for like a cool athleisure look. And actually like I work out in them. So I think they're great to work out in. They almost feel like old school like leotard like it feels like a leotard <laughs> like going to my gymnastics days um it feels like a leotard so it's super stretchy super comfortable and like i said it'd be really great for workouts last but not least my leopard bike shorts i feel like you just gotta kind of go basic with the leopard bike shorts unless they do actually have a matching sports bra with this which would be so cute with that um put even like a zip up over it i think it would be super cute um but for me a white basic t-shirt is the way to go you could easily do black as well or gray um but these t-shirts are so good they're actually from airy they're oversized and they're meant to kind of go with a bike short um, and i think they look really cute with bike shorts they're super comfortable i actually sleep in them i work out in them i <laughs> Do life in them so I really love them highly suggest them um, they do run really big though so size down one and then I just paired it with some chunky sneakers and a little belt bag this belt bag has been used so many times already since I purchased it it's from Lulu and it is awesome it's like a nylon little belt bag it fits my wallet my keys and my sunglasses and that's really all I need so love this thing it's very, very handy, but this is the outfit I pick with my leopard bike shorts. Guys, so that is it for my bike short style session. I hope you guys enjoyed this and it was helpful. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys want to see next for a style session. I would love to hear. Give this video a thumbs up if you did like it. Stay and subscribe if you're not, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.